everyone, this is RPG Maker Tutorial 1, um, the very basics, this is mainly for very, you know, beginner RPG Maker XP users, and today we're going to be learning about layers and text features. So up here is where all the layers are, we have layer 1, layer 2, layer 3, and the events layer. Obviously, layer 1 is at the bottom. Layer 2 is in the middle, and layer 3 is on top. And I, I, I hope you understand it. You know, just by saying layers, you should know that it's like a, a mask, basically. La anything on layer 2 goes on top of layer 1. Layer 1 is always there. It will never change, unless you change it. You know, by default, the map... The map is um, entitled Map 001 under RPG Maker Tutorial, or whatever you named your game, and it, it looks like that. You can change that later. And for Layer 3, you can put anything anything that goes over Layer 2. doesn't have to necessarily be trees. You can put trees for Layer 2. And that's what it would look like. See that? Um, the events layer is for events, manipulating where your events should be, where you want them to go, where you want them created, etc, etc. I'll get into events later, but not now. And now for some text features, actually. We're going to create an event right now. So on your events layer, you're going to double left click, and a new event will pop up. Automatically by default, EV001, or EV001. And I'm just going to title this Text Features. And I'm going to double right click under List of Event Commands, and the Event Command window pops up. The very first one is Show Text. And we have Text Input. You can only put in three lines of text. So this is some example text. You can only go in certain length uh, in text width okay um, it is recommended sorry if I misspell anything that you not go past the arrow and of course arrow is past the arrow, so it most likely won't show up in the game. You can preview your text by pressing F2. Um, features for the text show text event are all listed here. Okay. Um, I'm gonna here. You can display one's name. This is blank. Okay. One is the number of whatever the character's name you want displayed. I'll show you later. But if you want to display someone's name, you do backslash N and that character's number. If you want to display a certain color, backslash C, and then a color of a number. One is blue, I believe. Two is red. Three is green, I think. Not too sure there. Other features in text include is the, um, backslash backslash and then slash number replaces the value in variable number etc oh yeah backslash g opens the gold menu and that's pretty much everything I think you need to know about that for the text features and that's pretty much wraps it up for tutorial number one in RPG